Okay, uh, for some of you guys that uh, want to know how the magnetic wheels uh, are made, uh, I want to show you a little bit close-up of how they're made. Uh, this is an aluminum magnetic wheel. Uh, you can see I've got north, south, north, south, north, south, and so forth around the wheel. Uh, here's another wheel I had a machinist to make. Uh, you can see that the magnets are just dropped in and then I put the screws over top so they'll be in position. On the bottom side, I've got another hole and just in case uh, I want to get the magnets back out. <clears throat> Sometimes uh, the magnets are just a little bit snug so I have to peck them out. But anyway, you can see how this uh, wheel here is made. Uh, this is a seven inch diameter wheel made out of aluminum. Uh, over here is one I used for a while. I just made out of wood uh, where the magnets had uh, a center bore uh, where I could just put a screw through the center of them. And uh, you can see the other ones I have on the wall. Uh, that's a big magnetic wheel there. Uh, I believe that's, I'm not mistaken, that's the 18 inch diameter and the magnets are like one inch long by seven eighths inch diameter. And um, over here, uh, that one is a 24 inch diameter wheel. Uh, it has half inch magnets. Uh, see if I can get a close up. Uh, you can see the half inch. I did have the magnets on the outer edge and then I had some on the inner edge which they either way they work pretty good and uh, of course that's the copper pipe that I had on the other video uh, this this one here is also uh, one made out of a solid surface material uh, it works pretty good too so uh, all thing better about uh, the aluminum made in machine shop is pretty well balanced so if you turn it at high speeds uh, it doesn't uh, vibrate uh, but I have made a few out of wood that uh, work just as well but uh, I'll show you here in just a second of uh, how this works uh, this is actually a wood shaper I've got here in my shop and the motor is a three horsepower motor, uh, 3400 RPM, but I have the pulley now set on the slowest speed it will go. This has a slower speed and a high speed. Uh, I don't know the exact RPMs, but uh, it's on the lowest speed. So I'll turn that on here in a second and show you what kind of heat you can get from uh, just this wheel. Okay, here we go. Here's the copper pipe. Uh, got my hand. Pretty cool. Man's cool. Everything's cool. <laughs> Even this part here is pretty pretty warm to hold to.
Okay, uh, I want to show you a little uh, close-up of the copper turning orange uh, to give you a little idea of how hot it really gets. see there's no heat whatsoever on the magnet and uh, copper pipe still hot Still a little bit too hot to hold. That will give you a little better idea than the other video.